hello again welcome to a new week if you are a returning subscriber thank you you're the real mvp but if you're new to my channel hello my name is grace but you can call me gracie and i am on a journey to go 22 inches of hair yes you heard right girl i want them inches so i will be using different products and techniques that i will hopefully be able to incorporate into my usual hair care routine so that i can reach that goal sooner rather than later so if that's something you're interested in then please do consider subscribing and of course hitting that notification bell so you know every time i upload and while you're there why not follow me on my other social media accounts which should appear somewhere around me right now and if at any point during my hair growth journey you do decide to use one of the products or techniques that i'm using then please go ahead and use this hashtag gracie crew growth journey so that i know that you are one of us so with that being said let's get into this video So yeah, I just wanted us to start with a little recap, then of course, let's get into the moment we've been waiting for. So as you can see, not a lot of difference and honestly, this is why I was saying previously that I do need to get a tape measure, um, but I did try my best to make things as accurate as possible. And of course, if you're new to my channel, you know that for every length check, I always try to make sure that I am as accurate as possible. So yeah, that's why I am going back in just to ensure that I did get the measurements correct and I wasn't just tripping. And yes, I did get a ruler. I may not have found a tape measure yet. I'm still looking, but I did grab my ruler just so we can see how long my hair is and i'm pretty proud because i remember the very last time i used any type of measurements to look at my hair i remember my hair was only like four inches so you're gonna see that in this particular day like this is day 21 of course you'll see that my hair is give or take about let me just say seven inches maybe just a little bit over seven inches um but you're going to see um as i'm going uh, back in each time just to double check as i said on this channel we make sure that we double check so that we are as accurate as possible so yeah i continue going back in to double check the length so as you can see give or take my hair right now is about seven inches um so we can say just maybe like 7.1 or 7.2 somewhere there um and i did go back in the first time as i said i think i grabbed a longer strand of hair um but this time i decided to go for as many hairs as i could still hold that could still hold on to my finger like i was still pressed down onto the ruler and yeah i went with that so that's how i came up with the 7.1 ish ish inches So my final thoughts, would I try Moringa again? Yes, I would. I have been learning so much about my hair, so much about how to take care of it. And of course, hair growth is not just about the products we 
use it's all about all the little other things we do as well to help out our hair as i said in one of my other tips of the week video i was facing some you know split ends and stuff so that in itself is also motivating me to continue on this journey so as i said before if you would still like to you know continue on this journey with me i still have quite a long ways to go as you can see from our length chat length check sorry today so yeah please do consider subscribing it's always a joy to have more people the more the merrier okay <laughs> okay guys so that's all about our 21 days of moringa join me next week to see what i'll be using in my hair so we can grow a few more inches over the next 21 days bye